The BMAT can be taken in August or September and October or November each year. It can also be taken in February or May, but this is just for universities outside of the UK. The general content of the exam on these two dates is the same. However, there are some key differences to consider when selecting your BMAT test date. Taking the earlier BMAT will allow you to receive your BMAT score before you apply to medical school and submit your UCAS choices. As a result, you can optimise your UCAS choices accordingly. So you could apply to two or more BMAT universities if you score highly, or only apply to one BMAT university if you do not score as well relative to your UCAS score and wider application credentials. The earlier BMAT test date is generally only available at pre-selected test centres, whereas the later sitting is available at most schools and colleges. As such, the test fee is presently higher for the earlier sitting, although this can be claimed back depending on financial circumstances. In order to be eligible for the earlier testing date, you must register online by early August. If this date has already passed, Unfortunately, the latter BMAT remains your only suitable option. Preparing for the BMAT should not be rushed and takes a minimum of four weeks, ideally longer. If you're taking your UCAT exam or have significant work experience arranged for late August or September, it would be advisable not to rush your preparation and instead take the BMAT in October or November. In summary, the answer to this question depends on individual circumstances, especially taking into consideration the UCAT, work experience, test locations and finances. However, should none of these factors affect you, we would recommend taking the BMAT in August or September due to the significant benefit of having your BMAT score before making your university choices.